Hi Pisces, how are you? If you're new, how are you? My name is Michelle and today we're going with your reading. Um, I want to remind you guys that my readings have an update. They are different. Everything has to be well. Not everything is going to resonate with everybody. Please keep in mind that roles could be reversed in between energies. And with this said, let's move forward. Also, I did record your video last week, but I don't know what happened. It got messed up, so, you know? It's because my memory, that my, my, the memory was completely full, so, you know, I guess it was my fault there. Trying to make too many videos with one memory, with the memory card that I had. Because the other ones were full, because I've been recording multiple videos and editing, and that's been my life lately. <laughs> but anyways. So we got here the energy of Libra. We definitely got Pisces. We got Cancer as well. We have Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, and a lot of air. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. We're very focused on Libra. At the bottom, we got Leo energies. Okay, so it does seem right here that I feel like somebody did hurt you a lot. That it caused like a scar. And it's like, I will say, like, it's becoming quite hard for you to not necessarily make connections, but, like, to trust people. I feel like there's a lot of, like, you know, I don't want to get hurt again. I just don't know if I should trust this person. So it's, like, an intensity here of, like, you know, I just really do not want to get uh, get played, right? I do feel like you have opened your heart multiple times and they you get betrayed. And sometimes I feel like some of you got, got betrayed by close people. I do feel like there's a sense of like you, you feel like your energies are not cherished. That your sacrifices are not cherished. It's like you could feel like you give everything to everybody but you don't receive anything. It's like the question is like why am I not worth trying or why am I not worth changing? Why am I not worth giving? You know? But I got good news for you. Uh, there's an energy, a new energy, a new uh, love energy here. For some of you, this could be an opportunity with a f uh, with a air sign. Of I was gonna say a friend. I don't know what that is, but somebody from the past. For some of you, and others are this could be completely new. But I do see it's like a f uh, air, uh, a breeze of fresh air. It's like an opportunity that balances everything out. It's like this person is going to show you why the other people that you tried to work things out did not work so this is the reason why things did not work out with other people and this person is going to make everything make sense it's like oh now i see why it didn't work out with such and such so this is the person and this is the reason why the other people did not work with you because you were made not made but meant to meet this person and because it's like it's like it balances everything out like you guys are very compatible with the nine of wands and the three of pentacles in the reverse right here this is going to be like a connection like no other um this person if you knew this person you guys could have worked together or went to school together um if you don't have any re you don't recall anything from the past or let's say that you don't want to claim that part it could be that you're going to meet this person in school or work it's a connection of somebody's work and somebody's school okay I do feel like it's not going to be the same as the past like I said before this is like no other this is a whole new connection it seems very positive it seems very healthy allows you to be yourself without putting too much pressure on becoming a better person it's like it, it just happens within the connection you know uh, I do see here the only thing is that there's like some sort of things that needs to be worked on um, I feel like this person it specifically is connected to well, a fake soulmate or perhaps this could be a situation that they feel bonded and tied down to a specific person but it's not because they are in love necessarily but it's because maybe it's an on and off situation they could have some properties together they could have kids together or they could have something together so it's like an external thing that keeps them together but i just feel like your person or this person could be in a situation that again it could be quite toxic and they need to work things those things out before jumping in but you're gonna meet them 
halfway when you're gonna meet this person they're gonna be halfway getting over the situation and getting done with the situation right it's not gonna be just there it's gonna be like halfway with the four pentacles in the reverse uh no this is not like an old baby daddy ma uh, baby mama situation it's something about livelihood it's something about money it's something about like they're there because they don't have anything to do not anything but like nowhere to go so it's like a need more like a want and like i said before you're gonna meet them halfway almost done so at this point it sounds it may sound bad right now but you will understand better whenever the time is right and you're gonna see like oh i remember what this girl said <laughs> this promises to be a worth investment this is a representation of the universe giving you exactly what you want remember that the universe will give you what you want more like it's not like what you want it's more like what you need and this could be also referring about timing so at this point like i said before this person will be the reason and the understanding of why nothing worked in the past because the minute you connect with this person everything makes sense you guys are sick and the same thing will happen to this person towards you right so I just see here that there's no judgment from neither of you. Like I said before, I do feel like you both are going to feel very chill next to each other. Uh, I do feel like people are going to notice your glow. They're like, oh my gosh, Pisces, I've seen you. I have never seen you this happy. And it's because of this person. Things are not going to happen super fast, okay? And this is the thing that you may like too with the Nine of Swords and the Reverse because actions are being taken with care from both ends so this is not something that will happen like that it's not something that is going to be rushed or anything it's like you're going to have the time to get to know this person to find more about this person and to understand the situations in both ends okay so with this said guys hold on so you will understand and i do see like the love may not happen overnight because that's just kind of like impossible sometimes you're gonna be in sync you're gonna connect there's gonna be attraction it's gonna be like undeniable chemistry but love is gonna be grow it's gonna grow within time so it's like you may even not notice it you may even deny it for a bit you're like oh no i don't want this person or i don't want to be in this situation but it grows this love and this connection grows within time within you guys knowing each other i do see that you're gonna could have a panic attack or anxiety because you're like oh my gosh i'm here again after i said i don't want to be in a relationship after i say i don't want to be hurt like you're gonna be in a way to perform panicking because it just feels so intense and you're like i really didn't want this to happen in a way because you could have said like oh no i want to be single da, 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 da. and this person comes in unexpectedly and changes everything and you're like what the heck is going on but they're saying to not focus on the worst case scenario because it's unnecessary because it hasn't happened yet with the five of ones you often be like oh my gosh this person is gonna cheat on me <laughs> or what what's coming after this like what kind of hurt is coming after this no they're not gonna hurt you they don't mean to that like i said before you're gonna meet them halfway and soon they're gonna be available with the ten of ones it's because you have worked very hard like i said before you have worked very hard in past relationships and perhaps you feel like it's heavyweight you feel like you give it all you don't get nothing back things don't change it's like it's the same person in a different body it's because you were meant this person again this connection is the reason why things did not work you also are the reason why it did not work with other people for this for this person and you guys are going to be cross, crossing paths again it's going to be like a divine union and if you know me or maybe let's say this is your first time watching me i'm not the kind of tarot reader that promises that if you see my other videos you see that in every single sort of sign i'm very very honest and i'm not telling you this so i can feed your delusion not at all no not at all this is honestly uh i've seen your past readings that i created for you right with the cards and all that and i've seen how much hard time you had had in the past and how much fake energies you have been encountering and how much overcoming you have done and i do see like this is your time to shine this is your glow this is a new beginning but it's not a crazy new beginning with the full and the various areas energy i do see it's like new but it's not like gonna be a new risky it's like middle ground it's like grounded energy day 
the Hierophant. This could lead to ma marriage. This could lead to higher levels of commitment with the Hierophant towards energy. Like I said before, you're like the yin yang energy. So like you're div divine feminine, divine masculine. Of course, not gender. We're talking about energies here. And we're seeing here that you guys are just a good match, a perfect match. It's like the puzzle, the piece, pu the, the puzzle, the, the piece for this puzzle that is life. This person may not be as, again, tall as you may want it or physical. They may not be a thousand percent how you, you ideal your person. Again, I'm not saying that they're short, but I'm just giving you examples here. Whatever idea you have of physicality, they may not be a thousand percent that. And if we compare them with your exes, they may not look the same. And people be like, are you sure you like this person? But the thing is that you're going to fall in love with their energy. You're going to fall in love with their soul. And you're, and each one of you souls are going to recognize each other. Because I can, sh I can say and I can see that you guys have met before in the past. In the past life. There's nothing to be scared about. There's nothing that's coming that you need to wait for. Like, there's a secret coming to light. There's none of that. They're not faking. They're not going to leave. They don't want to play you. None of that. Um, I do see that this person tends to be a little bit to themselves. They don't tend to be the best texter or the best communicate uh, communicative person at first. Because it's not that they're shy. It's just like they're afraid of rejection. They're afraid of getting their high hopes, you know. And... Uh, it's just give it time, get to know this person, let them show you with their actions what they mean because they will be. With an uh, king of pentacles in the reverse right here, they may not come with a lot of money. Like they may not have a lot of money. They do have money. They do work. I do see a person that's hard worker and all that. But this is not somebody who has a lot of money, just so you know. But love and fulfilling your cup is always going to be there and i feel like they could become the person in the money sense too but you got to give it a break it's giving me number four i don't know if it's four months four weeks four years i don't know what this is but some something about number four is quite important and also it's talking about april too um for others of you so at this point um it says right here that it's been uh, tough four years for some of you or four weeks or four months but I do see it's more four years and it says like everything's gonna come to their senses after this person comes into your life <laughs> look look the wheel of fortune I do see changes I do see a uh, good fortune I do see letting go I do see having to adjust and all of that I do see unexpected changes that could make make you feel like oh my gosh this is bad but it's not bad change is just difficult you get to adjust yourself and eventually things make sense but just be careful with what you wish for that's what they're telling me finally they're saying right here that no this is not gonna break your heart you guys are going to get your heart like heart healed in a way to perform with this connection here and it says right here that you both are in the same energy you both are defensive over the connection that's why it's going to be such a good thing because you both are defensive of their connection because you have been hurt before both of you so at this point it's like you guys understand each other's pain and each other's goals and finally it says right here with the world right here is pretty much saying that endings are happening for beginnings to start and again is going back to like the reason why your other relationship did not work why the connection did not go too far or why it always always ended or it was difficult is because you were meant to connect with this person Person, and this person was meant to be in your life so at this point um that is why like i said before it does happen uh i do see the same energy uh about their situation uh, why things did not work for them so at this point again um that's that <laughs> let me give you a final message from the oracles um let me see what they have here it says only you devoted attach and crave it says fantasy daydreaming imagining oh it says withdrawn single lonely so it says right here that this love is only something that you could imagine and is going to feel like ecstasy so you're going to be quite like hesitant because like i said before for a long time that's something that you could only imagine and now it's coming true and it's going to be scary at first because of that but this is right here that you situation and all the things was for you to self-growth for self-focus for self-finding for nurturing yourself and it says right here that time it was all about time it was timing and the reason why things did not work and that's why things are going to work now is because timing was not the best timing 
and now is the best time and it's like the universe was waiting for the both of you to grow to become better persons to find each other like so Fi uh, finding or searching for you both to be perfect for each other but this is where your moment is now and it was all about time um at the bottom right here it says chemistry you guys will have an amazing chemistry like i said before this attraction this spark th this sparks this passion like i said before i think you're gonna like this if you don't then it's fine too but anyways guys this is the energy reading i hope you liked it if not oh well i also want to encourage you to not only subscribe and like my video to also follow me outside of youtube you can find me on tiktok you can find me on instagram you can find me on twitter uh you can find me on spotify you can find me on twitch um you can find me on discord literally i'm most in every part in every part twitter like i said before uh all the description box you're gonna find all the links and i also offer personal readings for those interested so you want to check out the link in the description box below so with this said guys thank you so very much and you guys have an amazing day